Hey everybody, I'm back with my Asus U43. Uh, my Samsung uh, Solid State is in there, and we're actually I'm gonna go ahead and turn it on after installing using the AI uh, recovery for Asus. So let's see what happens when I turn it on. Oh wow, okay, so it's saying that there's no proper boot device. That's weird. Um, well, alright. So, if this happens to you guys, what I recommend you do is, first of all, go ahead and just, you know, turn it off. And then when you turn it back on, uh, usually it's either F8, F2, or F12 that sends you into the BIOS, or uh, the boot. Alright, so here we are. And... Right here we have, go through the selections, to boot, and we have boot options. Boot option one is my Samsung. So, for some reason, it just didn't work. Um, I'm not sure why. Um, you know, I put all five desks in there, I went through the process, said you're done, go ahead and restart, and that's what I did. And then, uh, you guys saw the rest. So, we're going to go ahead and, uh, since everything is in order here, Let's see if uh, yep, everything looks good. Alright, so let's go ahead and just escape, exit without saving. Yes, we're going to go ahead and shut down. Okay, if this happens to you and you're trying to update your uh, your laptop to a SSD card, what I recommend is uh, you get a flash drive and you make a boot drive. It's really easy to make a boot drive. I will make a video. Uh, you go ahead and you put your boot drive in. And you select which uh, device you want to boot. So do that again by pressing either F8, F10, or F2. Depends whichever one your computer is. Um, choose your boot device option. I believe you could just. Ah, here we go. So, to move it up, I believe you just, there you go, yeah, you just press the uh, up key and it moves it up, awesome. We're going to go ahead and press F10, it's all like save, your res save and reset, yes. Now it's going to restart, and it's going to start off our uh, Windows 7 uh, Bolt boot USB tool, here it goes booting. And uh, we're going to see what's what's happening here. Um, we're going to go into the command prompt and see uh, if we can actually see the drive. Perhaps I got a faulty drive or you know, the drive is just not reading right. But let's go ahead and uh, just see what happens first, okay? Starting Windows, doing all that good stuff. Here we go. Alright, let's go to next, and we're going to go to install. We're just going to try to install a uh, regular version of Windows 7. It has the Windows key on the back that I can just enter. Um, and I'll just have to download all the drivers later, which is no big deal. And maybe I can even do a video for that as well. So we're going to go to custom. And uh, for some reason, there are no dry, dry sound. That's really weird, but uh, there's nothing we can do about that. So we're going to go back. Back. Um, and we're just going to exit out. Yes. And here we are. So let's go to repair your computer. And it's going to search a few things, but, you know, I, I don't really know what to do here. So I'm going to go ahead and just go into the command prompt from here. To do that, you just press Shift and F10. That does change on each computer, so, uh, you know, just, you know, do some research if it doesn't work the first time, but shift F10, and there you go, there's the command prompt. Uh, we're going to go ahead and put disk parts, and this gives us uh, the disk partitions and everything, uh, and we're going to see if it, uh, if it reads the Samsung, uh, because we did read, we did see that it read it in the BIOS, but for some reason it's not reading it here. So, list disk. 
Alright, there it is, disk 01. So we're going to go ahead and select disk 0. Um, and we're going to list partition. Um, that's supposed to be a list partition. And we're going to try to select par 1. Uh, so there you go, there's a problem right there. It's not letting us select partition. So um, let's go ahead and uh, just do clean all. This should delete all the partitions on the drive. So, and I did buy this SSD used, and I understand that SSDs are, uh, you know, they, they do diminish with each write, so, but I just wanted a, a solid state. I haven't had one yet, and uh, I got this, uh, this nice little laptop on a deal, and I figured it would just be really nice to have a solid state in it. So it's going to clean all. This may take a while. I'll bring you back, guys back when it does clean everything, and we'll go from there. Alright, see you guys soon.